Right, good morning to the ag community from the UK. Everyone watching with interest, especially Coventry Police, West Midlands Police Force, and uh, as well as our Centre Doctors Association psychiatrists, all the health care, NHS people, mm-hmm. all the mental health people, and the non corrupted uh, the non corrupted Coventry people, and the local gang who's uh, abusing me, my mother and my brother. Right, everybody, these cameras, these cameras are being used by criminal gangs. Yeah, the Broken Old Dawn Association, firemen gangs, armed forces gangs, yeah, and broken fraudsters in Coventry who spent the money on getting these cameras and putting them all over the city to steal from people in Coventry. Yeah, it's happening all over, all over the UK, and this is what, what the gangs have resorted to. Yeah, using see for raw technology, thermology cameras, yeah, and uh, doing burglaries, yeah, and making videos of people. And getting kicks out of dirty, disgusting, voyeuristic videoing. Yeah, watching couples having sex. Or watching people in showers, in bathrooms, in bedrooms. Yeah, could be watching your sons and daughters, country people. And UK people. Yeah, could be watching your grandmother, your grandfather. Or any family. Yeah, so this is what, what the gangs. There's all kinds of gangs in Coventry. There's Indian gangs, Eastern European gangs. Which are circulating on the side of my mother's house. Yeah, there's the English gangs who uh, think they control the city and paying off all the foreign gangs, yeah, for many racketeering purposes. Yeah, and the, there's the Jamaican gangs, the African gangs, and they're putting it all on websites. So that's why Coventry Social Services, Coventry Healthcare, Coventry NHS, and there's ones like Centre Doctors Association psychiatrists can't touch me, my mother and my brother. Because also these gangs, when they're evil, Vindictive. They'll sit there radiating people to death, radiating you, radiating your mother, radiating your father, radiating grandmothers, grandfathers to put them to out of care homes because you get kicks out of it. Yeah, they could be radiating your backside, radiating your genitals, radiating your eyes, radiating your limbs. Yeah, and then using microwaves as well to a to a microwave from the inside out so that your internal organs fail. Yeah, this is what I'm exposing to Coventry and all the names I have put out there. Yeah, they, they, they do it. Yeah, that's one of them will face me. The two idiots who, who passed me last week. Yeah, one, yeah, by Stoke Green, by the Coventry Budden Society. He's involved in it. He's an ex armed forces boy. Yeah, the other one who passed me in town both said the same thing. Oh, oh what are you doing mentioning my name? Yeah, and I goes, oh, well, you shouldn't be going around doing these crimes. Yeah, they're all involved in it all because they've been targeting people to put into the sectors and been, been picking their rivals off, people they've, they've fell out with, yeah, and been red in them. Yeah, even the lad, pop by Stoke Green, he mentioned to hate loads of people or fell out with loads of people. He's an ex-armed forces boy. He's been doing it for decades and generations and I hope he rots in prison. Well, the other lad, yeah, he's put loads of people in. Yeah, the social services, the mental health and got these people uh, brain damaged. Yeah, psychotropic medication, antidepressants and antipsychotics. So everyone I mentioned, a lot of them are involved in it all and they deserve to go to prison and rot in prison forever. The old dormant association, they need to be investigated. They're sickos, they're evil. Our armed forces boys are sickos or evil. Lyndon Logan, evil. Zena, evil. He and his mother, who watches people, because now they can uh, attach these cameras, yeah, to a, to be collaborated with an internet device, internet streaming, yeah, and the internet stream all, all the targets, all over the world, to people with the same mentality as them, as evil, criminal-minded wrongdoers. No one's allowed to tell a big brother, so all the gangs who do this worldwide, you deserve to be locked up for life. All you gang stalkers out there in the UK and all around the world, you deserve to be rotted in hell, rotted in prison for life, for washing people in their homes and on the in the everyday vicinity 24 hours a day. Yeah, but the, the people who are doing it linked to the drugs industry. Yeah, putting drugs on the streets. Yeah, and stealing from, from anyone who's not in their gang. Yeah, and the fraudsters, the criminal-minded idiots, who, who, who do it also for the people they know in healthcare, social services, mental health, and for medical research, yeah, they, yeah, they've all put money into it all because they get paid 
by the industry, whoever they're sending the data to, sociologists, human behavioral scientists, the medical industry, healthcare, NHS, and mental health, college kids, university kids, and to the senior peers who want to see the experiments, like the twisted psychiatrists, twisted psychologists, who want to see MK Ultra, Karinja Paul, noise harassment, sound harassment, being done on the targets who they call subjects. Yeah, so so I've displayed this, this, this now. I mean, this, this camera's really old. Back in the day, it would have cost six, eight thousand dollars, six thousand to eight thousand dollars. Now, so you have to think they're more technical, sophisticated. Can be collaborated to, to be to be streamed onto the internet. Can be collaborated to internet peripherals, and the targets can be streamed onto the internet. Well, the optic zooms, they can put in all kinds of different optics in, different lenses in to have a high collaborated optic zoom. So they can sit in, like I said, sit above shops and zoom in on the targets. Yeah, through the town sensors. Yeah, and so also don't forget the police as well. They use these style type of cameras and they use the ALRAD, the radar, see through all technology. That's what, it's, that's what we call it, see through all technology. So everyone in Coventry, open your eyes. And anyone you know who's got, he's got, he's, he's got, he's got these cameras, let's imprison them for life. Anyone you know who's streaming the targets, let them to Coventry people, to West Midlands people, around the UK and all over the world, let's imprison them for life. Yeah, every man, every woman, every boy and girl, you've got these cameras, yeah, we want it taken off here. And the proceeds of crime, and the vorism, and the sickening, murdering crimes, radiating crimes. And whoever, because whoever this gang is in Coventry, you listen to me now, I'm coming for you, we're going to imprison you. Don't care if it's an old dorm association. Don't care if it's some be a fireman. Don't care if it's a police officers. You're going to be imprisoned. And you've broken Ryan Lewis, Tony Chapman. We're going to imprison you for life. You're a bunch of evil fuckers. 160 pixels across. You can see the um, lens looks silver. It's opaque for visible. These things cost about six, $7,000 new. I'm sitting on the couch. The hot spot it leaves behind, and the can of coke is a little bit dark, and I can look like I've been attacked by giant squids by stamping cold rings on all on my scalp, or turn the inside of my mouth black. Can, they can see what I visualize. If I visualize something, or they can read my thoughts, hear my thoughts, talk to me in my head. But they can, they can, they can see what you visualize in your head. Like if I picture something, they can see it. I've gone to clinics and tested positive, but when I go to major hospitals, it's so only with that people. That's the website there, Asylum of Ghosts. I want to check the camera out, check the people that are suffering, being tortured by these evil, narcissistic gangs all over the UK and all over the world. Yeah, the powers that be, you have to give stiff prison sentences to them and lie them off. Communities and families and people they're abusing like me around the world ain't going to tolerate it until you start giving stiff prison sentences to all the gangs who have got these cameras cover operators and the abusers of authority and give them life for looking into people's homes. Over and out. Everybody digest it all, so I can analyse it all. And let's bring these local criminal gangs in Coventry, let's arrest them, yeah, ASAP, and let's destroy their 2023. Over and out. <laughs>